Hey everybody, hope you're all doing well. I'm down here on the beach today for a spot of coin shooting with the Nocta Legend and the LG30 coil. I'm Adam, this is my metal detector, and that's a beach. Welcome to Detect Sussex. Okay, it's a gorgeous morning down here on the Sussex coast. I'm down here with the Not Legend, and I've chosen the LG30 coil because I've only got a couple of hours to play with today, and I want to get as much coverage as I possibly can on the beach. Um, in terms of settings, because I'm up on the dry, the tide's all the way in, this is gonna be my settings for the day. Pause the screen if you need to. There we go. Let's get cracking. Okay, first target of the day. Solid 28. All the way to the right on the ferry check. Three to four bars on the deck. Let's have a look, see what we've got. Oh, moved it. Okay, it's out. Oh, I can see it. I can see it. Starting the day off right. <laughs> A little bit out. On ward. Okay, next signal. Got one here, coming up early 40s. Three to four bars on the depth, all the way to that on the ferry. Check. Sounds good. Let's have a look. Let's see what we've got. Pound coin territory. Oh. Oh, whatever it is, it's out already. Let's have a look and see what we've got. Probably would have seen it if it was a pound coin, so it's probably something small and tatty. But we'll have a look. No, it's not that. Got it. Okay, tiny, tiny, tiny little bit of tats. All right, more to find on ward. Okay, ringing up at 27, ring pull onward. Okay, really powerful signal coming in at 52. I saw it going to the scoop. Some kind of a hook. Yeah, modern day thing. Unusual for the beach though, eh? Yeah. Onward. Okay, I'm just uh, slowly making my way down towards the pier, swinging as I go, hitting a few hot spots on the way. Um, we should start seeing some coins coming up when we get a bit closer. All being well. No. Um, my arm is killing me today, <laughs> swinging the detector around. Um, I did a CrossFit competition yesterday with my gym, and uh, yeah, let's just say I'm aching a little bit today. It was very hard work. But I always get a video out every week, so I'm out here grinning through the pain. <laughs> Let's carry on, see what else we can find. Hopefully we can get some coins shortly. Right, I've been waiting for this moment for a few weeks <laughs> since the, uh, the last update, the testing update came out. 
um, they introduced a bottle cap rejection and this is the first bottle cap that I've found that is actually going to work with a bottle cap rejection. I've only found aluminium ones to, so far and it's only going to work with the ferrous ones like this one. Okay, so that's a, uh, a Budweiser beer cap. Other brands are available. Now if I zoom out slightly, I can show you the screen. Okay, so to get to the bottle, bottle cap uh, rejection setting, you go to your settings, you go over to recovery speed, which is where I'm at now, and you hit the pinpoint button. Boom. And that you, you get extra settings there. So you've got your iron filter, stability, bottle cap, and uh, ground stability. So there's bottle cap. Uh, I've got a little bit of clouding on my on the case for the legend. Um, I dropped it in the sea earlier. <laughs> that's uh, the case, not the, not the machine. So sorry if you can't see that very well. But it's just a BC at the side there, and that's your bottle cap rejection. So I've got it on zero, so that's off. This is what it sounds like off. Yeah. Nice screaming signal. Let's zoom out a bit so you can see the screen a bit better. There we go. Yeah. Screaming signal. Could be a coin. You don't know. You're going to dig it, right? So, bottle cap rejection. If I go up to four, it should be about halfway. So, it's picking something up, but it doesn't like it. Right, it was coming up 51 to begin with. Now it's all over the shop on the numbers. If I go really slowly. There it is. But if I go wide, yeah, it doesn't like it. So we set it up to, go bulk cap rejection, up to eight, which is fully on. There we go. Yeah. And just to show that I am passing over, I'm going to zoom all the way in. All right, where is it? There it is. Yeah. Go really close to it. Just about find something occasionally. But it's not a digger. It's not something you dig. Look, if you had bottle cap rejection on, you probably wouldn't detect a single ferrous bottle cap. That's amazing. I'm going to leave the setting off for now. If I find any more, I'll do the test again. But uh, yeah, that is impressive. Cool. All right. Let's find find some coins, shall we? Onward. Okay, I've got a target here coming in. It's at 3940 on the machine. I'm just coming down to it. Looks like I need to get the trowel on it. So I'm just going to grab that from my belt. So we can get down to it. A little bit of uh, compacted sand here. Okay, let's see if we're still there. Yep, yeah, still there. Scrap. Never mind. Oh, onward. Okay, next signal. It's a screamer. I'll switch into six tone. Um, give that a try for a bit. That's a 48 on the VDIs. Let's see what we've got. It's quite sort of compacted sound in this area, so. There's quite a few people about, so I'm going to turn the speaker off so you won't hear the tones, but I'll hear them in the headphones. Still 48 when I'm dead over it. Let's 
Okay, so the tone sensor either disappeared or changed. I'm getting a... Oh no, it's just there just. So I must have moved it. It's still in roughly the same place, but it's uh, it's changed, so I must have moved it, so I've got to be close. Got it, it's out. Okay, what is it? First and foremost, where is it? It's here somewhere. Oh, oh, we've got something round. We've got something round. Is it a coin? Looks like a coin to me. Probably a TP with no, no, those numbers. Let's zoom in a bit. There we go. Oh, look at that, it's bent. Yeah. Not sure that'll be spendable, sadly. Yeah, it looks like a 2P to me. A bit grossy. We won't count that as a spendable. That's a 2P. So, first coin of the day. Hopefully getting to the area. There's going to be a few more coins we're out with the... Uh, here now so yeah hopefully we'll find a few more coins in this area so onward okay so just out of here next to the other one got another 48 signal and it's another bent <laughs> 2p so again we'll call that non-spendable i don't think many shops will accept it in that condition and there we are another 2p so we're finding coins just uh, maybe not in the condition we would quite like Let's carry on, on wood. Come up solid 48 is one of them. If anyone knows what one of them is, let me know down below because I do not know what one of them is. Yeah, got a little bit of weight to it. Not a clue. Onward. Well, that's my time up on the beach today. I've got to head home now. So not a huge amount coming up on the fine today. I was hoping for a few more coins than that. A couple of Guata 2Ps, a few little bits of uh, standard beach towel. I was able to do a little test on the bottle cap rejection again, which was uh, really good uh, to actually give that a proper try and uh, really good results on that. I think you'll agree. Um, but hey, I've had a lovely morning here on the beach. Look at the weather, look at the sky, look at the sea. Beautiful scenery, gorgeous stuff. So, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave me a like down below. Comments are always welcome. And share the video with your friends. And uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And you can follow my adventures with my metal detector every single week. I'm going to try and get out on my land permission soon. I'm still waiting to hear whether I can get back on them after the winter months. I uh, just need to make sure the land is um, okay for me to detect on again. Um, it's been a little bit inaccessible with uh, some of the wetness we've had recently a bit boggy um, but as long as that's uh, hardened up a little bit hopefully we can get out there very very soon and get some land detecting in so have yourselves a fantastic week everybody and i'll see you soon take care